Yes, this is Geolaser Will coming at you with another Destiny video. Today we are going to continue our Wrath of the Machine Ultimate Guide on how to defeat the five bosses within the raid. We already did boss one, boss two, and today we're going to be talking about Volsec. He is back, fellas. As you guys remember, when we first started the raid, he spawned and we had him a quarter of health down. But what he did is he teleported and went sevatized on us. And he kind of escaped, but now he's back. And uh, this time he has some sort of different game mechanics from the first previous one. But but have no fear, Laser's here to help you guys defeat him. Now, if you guys find these videos helpful and informative, make sure you guys drop a comment and like. Let's try to get this video to 200 likes. And don't forget to share with your friends because sharing is caring and it can help you guys complete the raid a lot faster. So the game mechanics on this one is fairly easy and easy to understand. It just requires a little bit of communication and team coordination. On the left hand side you'll get ads, on the right hand side you'll get ads, and in the middle you will go ahead and get ads. Uh, what's going to happen on the front of the screen, on the front there's going to be a bunch of TV screens. Uh, one of these TV screens is going to start glitching out. Once the TV screen starts glitching out, you're going to want to go ahead and shoot that TV screen. Once that TV screen is shot, then they're gonna it's gonna spawn a yellow captain on each side, middle, left, and right. Once this yellow captain is spawned, you will go ahead and kill it. Once that captain is killed, you will then go ahead and get the little balls or spheres that we got in the beginning that we should throw throw to him to bring down his shield. You are gonna want to throw these all together at the same time. So you're gonna have to time these with your fire team and say, ready, one, two, three, throw. And that is the only way you're going to bring out his shields quickly. All the three balls have to hit hit, hit him as quickly as possible and make sure you guys time them correctly. After three times of throwing the balls at him, his shield will be down and you will be able to do DPS. Once you do the DPS, it's when the fun part begins is because after you do DPS, he will then go ahead and start trying to recall you or sevatize you. When this happens, you are going to see either on the left hand side or the right hand side a room that lights up with a yellow light on the side. There's a total of four rooms on uh, on the whole map. On each side, there's two to the left, two to the right. The room with the yellow bar, you're going to want to go into that room. Everybody's going to want to run into that room when he does the SIVA thing and shoot the little light thing uh, that's on the door. Once you shoot the little light thing, a yellow door will drop down and that will prevent you from getting sevatized. And after that's done, you will be able to come out and do the same thing all over again and just keep doing that until he is down and dead. What I recommend for this uh, for this strike and for this boss is uh, have, one, have one person just be in charge of ad duty, have the other person be in charge of the monitor and of the sphere and that should be good to go. So if you have one person running around clearing ads and you have another person that is in charge of just shooting the um shooting the ads you have one person shooting the ads and you have one person in charge of just shooting the the tv screen and one person uh in charge of just throwing the ball on each side you guys should be good and get this completed fairly fairly quickly it's a matter of rinse and repeat and you guys should be good to go and that is how you guys defeat the Vosik and uh, take him down so he will no longer show you and appear on you. I hope you guys are finding this video helpful. If you are, like I said, drop a comment and a like, and I will catch you guys on the next video.